Everybody, how is everybody doing? We are in our second day. I cannot believe it. 
Oh man, the time is just going way too fast, way too fast. So while I was uh, getting ready to be on live here, I mean, the stream was live and I'm just sitting here waiting for the countdown and stuff. I'm looking at all the comments and stuff and I'm really happy you guys are digging the music. I'm just saying. Um, I uh, specifically wanted to find some upbeat, happy music. I love to dance. I grew up in the dance studio as a child and I always like to dance. And when I'm getting ready for lives, um, I'm really digging this countdown thing because it kind of gets me in the zone. It gets me all pumped up and stuff. So it's a really great thing. So I'm really happy that you guys are enjoying the music. I think next summit, I'm going to try to do a little bit different. So different types of music every day. I think that'll be fun. But I certainly didn't have time to do that this time. So anyway. All right. Awesome. So I don't have much in the way of updates today. But I do want to make sure that everybody who is a VIP All Access Pass member, if you have not opened up your email since 4 o'clock this afternoon, 4 o'clock Eastern, that is, um, so it's, what, 7 now, so 3 hours ago, um, you need to uh, check your email. Because I sent an email out to everybody who is a VIP All Access member as of 4 o'clock today. So if you joined after 4 o'clock, then you won't have that email. But I'll, I'm going to tell you where to get the information regardless. But I sent an email out to everybody who's a VIP All Access Pass member to remind you all that you need to register for the virtual crop that's going to happen on Saturday. We are going to have a lot of fun. It's going to be Saturday, 7 to 9 um, Eastern time. And we have, I have a, a room, uh, a th wor worth, uh, I have a room that will fit a thousand people in it. So um, make sure that you get there early, but first you have to actually register. So let me back up. So in the email, I sent you a link where you have to register to um, reserve a seat. Now that doesn't guarantee that you're going to have a seat because again, the room is limited. It's a, it's a zoom uh, restriction. So the first thousand come in now. I will say that last time um, we only had like four or 600 somewhere around there at any given time. So um, my suggestion is that you get there early so you can be the first one in when the doors open. Um, but I wouldn't stress over it because I don't think we're going to go over. But I just need to share that disclosure up front. That was... Um, on the FAQs um, on the sales page. So you all should have um, known that already, but I just wanted to remind everybody that if you want to come, you need to make sure you grab your seat as quickly as possible. Now, uh, if you can't find the email, but somewhere in your spam folder, no worries. So just log in to your VIP all access pass. And then in the top section under the welcome section, where you find the schedule, the summit library, um, you're going to find a page there that holds all of the virtual uh, crop information, how to register for Zoom. Once you register, register then Zoom is going to send you an email on where to go when it's time to actually uh, log in on Saturday. So, oh, it looks like a lot of people already registered. That's awesome that is so good so that's the main thing i wanted to make sure that everybody knew about who is a vip member um, now i will say that it's not too late um, we still have um, plenty of seats left if you want to go ahead and purchase your vip all access pass let me put that link up right there the link or the the uh, banner that's scrolling across here is the promotion that Alta New had shared with us yesterday on their live, and it's still valid. So I wanted to put it up again in case anyone was interested. Um, go to stampmesomelove.com forward slash Alta New and use the promo code Alta New 30 off for all of their washi tapes. All right, so let me go ahead and close that down. And let me see here. Let me get out of this folder. There you go. So what I'm scrolling down below there is the link to purchase the VIP All Access Pass if you have not already done so. So, all right, I'm just gonna let that flow and then we're gonna go straight into some giveaways. 
So we've got a lot to give away. I'm going to try to give away some before our next live in between. And then we're going to finish up after um, the last live today. So we've got tonight coming on. Um, just one second. All right. So our first live tonight is going to be with Pink and Maine. And then after that, we're going to do, um, we're going to have a crafty session with Ellen Hudson. So really excited about that. All right. But before we get into that, let's do some giveaways. All right, Lisa. <laughs> She's my VA back backstage. I have no idea what section I'm putting this in. So you just have to search for it. All right. So the first one we're going to do is our honeybee stamps. This is such a cute bundle. Let's take a look. All right. So we've got a rainbow themed bundle right here. So we have oh, this little adorable. I think it's a sticker. Little be creative. Isn't that cute? And we've got um, some rainbow gem stickers we've got some really pretty six by six pattern paper again rainbow themed oops put that on my keyboard then we've got the um buzzworthy stamps or actually that's that's her tagline sorry um which one is this Oh, Rainbow Wishes. Sorry, I didn't see it down there. So Rainbow Wishes is the stamp set. We've got the coordinating die set. And then we've got this cute little um, stencil, Rainbow Wishes. Stencil set of two. So there's two um, two stencils in there. All right, so let's go ahead and get, give that away. All right, the winner for the Honey Bee Stamp Rainbow Bundle. That's going to Marlene. And Marlene's uh, last name starts with an R and ends with a Y. All right, Marlene, we are going to be sending you an email over the next couple of days. So be sure to look out for that. It's going to come from support at Stamp Me Some Love. All right, we've got one here from TLC. Go ahead and then. All right, so here is the example card that she, um, Tammy sent over. Isn't that cute? And how clever is that? So she's folded this in half, and then it looks like she's maybe die-cutted through two sheets of um, cardstock at the same time. I'm not sure. Kind of looks like it. Isn't that pretty? All right, so here are the, the um, die set that she used to create it so we've got um it looks like let me see is that guy right there no 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 sorry so that little um piece of cake right there and here is the die plate that she used around it and then we've got another um looks like a nice little slim line um die there and another one right here just so cute i love that she has sent um samples with her giveaways that's so awesome. All right. Okay, so let's get it. Let's give this one away. All right. So the winner of the TLC uh, celebration. Let's see. I wrote it down. Sorry. Hold on a second. Mm, celebrate bundle is gonna go to Lisa. Lisa's last name starts with an R and ends with an O. Let me just check my time here, we got time. All right, so we're gonna do another one from Not Too Shabby. And this is the Happy Together um, stamp set. And I, when I get, gave this away, um, I think it was on Wednesday night, I mentioned to everybody, some of you know this, some of you don't know, but I'm a sign language interpreter for the deaf. I'm uh, certified and licensed. This um, symbol, which is what this is doing. So this is the sign for friends and this is best friends. 
So just a little side note, don't know if they meant that, but that is definitely what that means. It's really cute. All right, so let's go ahead and give that away. Okay, so the winner for the not too shabby uh, Happy Together stamp set is going to Rian, R-I-A-N-N-O-N as in Nancy. Last name starts with an F and ends with a K. All right, what else do we have here? Oh, you know what? We've got a big bundle from our friends over at scrapbook.com. Who doesn't love a little scrapbook.com? All right. So let's pull all of this out. Okay. Look at all this goody stuff. We've got we've got um, nice little scissors there. We've got an adhesive roller. We've got some cute shape dies, and then we've got a uh, word die here. And what does that say? You know, it's hard to read um, dies because they're always backwards. So that looks like life. Um, hap. Oh, let me just pull it out. <laughs> it doesn't say on the packaging. Well, maybe not. So if it that looks like. Sweet, sweet, love, maybe life. I think that's happy. I can't read it backwards. So anyway, if anybody knows what that says, put it in the chat. All right. Then we've got this adorable little bows, um, the stencil. And then we've got some cute little um, sentiments here. That's little scripted sentiments. It's all heart. And then, of course, we have their um, smooth cardstock sherbet color rainbow thing. It's beautiful. All right, so let's go ahead and give this away. All right, so the winner of the scrapbook.com bundle is going to... Valerie. And Valerie's last name starts with an M and ends with an L. All right. Who else we got? What time is it? Oh, looks like we should probably stop doing the giveaways. And it looks like we've got Michelle backstage. Michelle, if you can hear me, give me a big thumbs up if you are ready to be, to be brought onto the stage. I see you smiling, but I don't see your hands. Is that a yes? Yes. All right. Awesome. I'm going to bring her to the stage. One second. All right, Michelle, can I, can you hear me? Hi, I can hear you. Can you hear me? I can hear you. So unfortunately I'm going to have to have your other camera up when we're face, face to face, because I think that's where I'm hearing you out of because your other um, camera, that face front one is muted. So that's why we got three images on the screen right now. How okay. are you doing, Michelle? I'm great, thanks. I'm so excited to be here. Oh, I'm so excited for you. And I'm so happy because I see some flock. I see yes. flock down there. Yes. yes. So that's exciting. We did one of your bundles um, giveaways yesterday, I think it was, or maybe it was this morning. They're, they're starting to all blend together, to be honest oh, with you. Yes. <laughs> and everybody was so excited about the flock. So I'm really happy that you're actually going to demo that today. Oh, yes. Awesome. Fun. Awesome. All right. Well, I'm going to put your demo camera on full screen and then I'm going to take the two of us off. So let All me right. Go ahead Sounds and do good. that. All right. There you go. All right. Well, thanks for everybody for joining us this evening. Like I said, I'm super excited to be here. A little bit nervous, I, I must say. Uh, this is my first live streaming video so oh my goodness don't be nervous don't be nervous <laughs> but this is all fun stuff so it should be fun right yes yeah so absolutely I'm, I'm michelle i own pink and maine and i started in 2014 and we now carry lots of stamps and dyes and pattern papers and 
we have glue and adhesive sheets and paper pads. We have we have lots of fun stuff. And not too long ago, a couple months back, we introduced our line of flocking fibers. So we have 16 colors of flock. It's a lot. We have a lot of pretty rainbow colors. And we have plain flock, which is just the fibers. And we also have flock with glitter in it. So the color of the flock matches the color of the glitter inside. So if you've never used flock before, it just needs something sticky to stick to. So your glue or your adhesive, your double-sided tape, it'll stick to all those things. And it adds such a fun texture to your cards and your other projects because it makes things fuzzy. It almost feels like velvet or just a fuzzy teddy bear. So I have, I brought out some of the rainbow colors that we have, and these all include the glitter. And I thought I'd make a little card, just kind of showing you how you can use it and how easy it is. I have a white piece of cardstock cut down, and I've added our double-sided easy tear tape. So this is super strong, double-sided adhesive tape. And I just added it in stripes. And you just peel away the release paper, which is normally very simple. And so now it's super sticky there. And I'm going to add our first color of flock. I tried to come up with uh, fun little names for all of them. And it's really hard to come up with names for things that are fuzzy and also certain colors. But the red is Santa's hat because Santa's hat is fuzzy, right? So what you want to do is wherever it's sticky, we're just going to we're just going to dump the flocking on there and you want to be generous. Don't don't be shy. You just want to dump it on there. And then with your finger, you're just going to rub or burnish the glitter and the flock into the adhesive tape. Then we simply just tap off the excess. I have a wonderful paintbrush here that works perfectly for cleaning up flock and glitter. So anything that's sticking with static anywhere you don't want this brush just brushes it away i need that <laughs> yep. i need that in my life it, it makes it really nice cleanup and then you just dump the excess back into your jar I was telling everybody um, the other day when we were doing the giveaway is that once the, the project's finished, it kind of reminds me of those old Elvis paintings, you know, like oh, the velvet. Yes. Yeah. Or we used to get those posters that had black, black fuzziness on them and you colored them in with markers. Oh, yeah. I completely forgot about those. Yeah. So now we'll do the orange. Like I said, you just dump it on and rub it in. And don't worry about it mixing into the red. Once it's stuck down on that adhesive, you're not going to have anything else stick to that same adhesive. So as you can see here, we get a nice delineation between the orange and red with not too much uh, blending in there. And uh, Michelle, I forgot to mention at the top of your presentation that we were, um, we're gonna be sharing a special promo code oh, um, yes. that's going to be available tonight until 10 p.m. And that link is listed on the screen um, down below. It's scrolling. That's going to be at stampmesomelove.com forward slash pink and main, all one word, hyphen live stream special. And the promo code for that is CMSS22 to get 25% off all uh, your, your, your entire purchase um, tonight until 10 p.m. 
And what's really exciting too is we just had a brand new release today. We released our spring and Easter stamps and dies. So that's a great way you can save, you're the only people to save 25% uh, on those. Wow, that's exciting. Yeah. So instead of having me sit here and flock all those tapes, which, you know, you just do the same for each color. I went ahead and, and did one ahead of time. But you can see how the colors, you know, are very true to themselves. They don't blend over into each other. And um, we got this nice, pretty little rainbow here. I have an A2 size card that I've already glued down a red piece of cardstock. And then I've die cut a um, piece of our holographic cardstock. So it's really hard on the camera to get just how pretty and shiny and all the different colors in that. Yeah, it's looking kind of psychedelic right now. Yes, I'm sure it is. <laughs> so I'm just going to glue down the panel to the holographic piece here. And I wanted to give a little tip because I, I love this. Um, this is our Easy Squeeze Craft Glue, and we sell these stainless steel pins to keep your glue from clogging. And I glue my pin, I don't know if you can see that, I glue it into the cap. So I always know where my pin is, and it's always in the nozzle of my glue keeping it from clogging. Oh, that's that's clever. Just a quick little tip for you there. Hey, Michelle, we have a question. Do you ship international? Yes, we do. Okay. And so that promo code that we're showing, that would be okay for international customers to use? Yes, it will work. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Awesome. Now, I've got somebody asking questions about the flock itself. Amy is asking, sure. does it stick? Does this, does this stuff stick <laughs> firmly enough after dry for a visually impaired person to be able to rub it? Oh, yes. Yes, I can, I can rub this really hard and it's, it's not coming off. Once it's, once it's into that adhesive there, it, it's not going to come off. So it's, it's really fuzzy and it's, it's stuck to the adhesive. A fun thing too is you can you can write things with your glue or a you know like a glue pen you can because the flock will stick to the glue also so you mm -hmm. can write things with your glue and that will be awesome. a tactile thing as well. Somebody wants to know by the name of Strawberry that's a beautiful name can you die cut after flocking? You should be able to die cut as long as you're. Um, you have the sandwich right that you can go through the adhesive as well as your cardstock that's underneath. And definitely want to make sure it's completely dry before doing that. Yes, if you're using a liquid glue or anything, you want to make sure it's dry. Yeah. So I've just got um, a stamp, a really cute unicorn here from our Unicorn Dreams stamp set and I've die cut him out and I just put a little foam tape on the back and we're just going to put him on this flock rainbow here that's got follow your dreams Michelle can you hold the card up just a little bit to the camera yes I can thank you there we go. awesome look at that so cute I think that came out nice. And then, like I said, it, it just adds a fun texture. You just want to keep touching it. And I'd also like to show you uh, some other cards that I've done with the flocking. So here we have a card where I've also flocked in the glitter. The sparkling flock is what we call it, the ones with the glitter. And nice. this, this is our rainbow friend die. So the mm -hmm. die will cut out all of these in one pass through. Yep. And what I do is I put our adhesive sheet over the cardstock before I cut it out. And then you just peel the release paper for each piece or part of the die here. And you add the flock to it. Awesome. 
I have another little unicorn card. And for this one, I've added flock to a stenciled background. So I've taken our rainbow fun stencil and I used our glossy gel, which is kind of like a texture paste or texture mm -hmm. gel. It dries mm -hmm. clear, but while it's wet, you can add the flock to it and it will stick. Awesome. So here we have a fuzzy rainbow background. I do have a little tip on that um, last card you ha you just showed. So I created a card. I'm going to show it when we do the giveaway with that rainbow um, stencil. But mm -hmm. something not to do is to spray your stencil with pixie spray and then put the gloss gel down because once um, I pulled up the stencil, the glossy gel dried for the flock, but Everywhere that pixie spray was, um, a little extra flock kind of stuck to it. So just a little tip to oh. people who are using stencils. Don't put pixie spray on it. That is something to note for sure. Yeah, because if it's anything sticky, the flock will stick to it. And here I have a little, this is from our Lucky Leprechauns. And I used our Clover stencil for the background. I did the same Aww. thing with the glossy gel on green cardstock. And then used our our sparkling, we call it astroturf, or the green flock with the glitter. And then another card similar to the one that we did here a few minutes ago. It's just stripes of adhesive, and this is using the flock without glitter, and it still makes a really nice. The colors are really nice. And it just makes for just fun added thing to your cards. It's beautiful, beautiful. Awesome. Well, do you have anything else you'd like to share with us tonight? That is pretty much what I prepared to share. And I awesome. think in my mind that that ran longer than what I think it actually did, huh? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Let me bring your um, FaceTime or your face camera back up. Oh, let's see here. I always get confused here. Whoops. There we go. I will. Let's do that. All right. So we're going to see your overhead and your beautiful face at the same time. Let's go ahead and do your giveaway because okay, I know like a fun. lot of the a lot of the projects products that you use to create the cards um, that you've shown um, or some that are in this um, product pack. So I definitely want to pull all of that out. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to go solo for a second so I can show everybody all of this good, um, these crafty goodness here. Okay. All right, so let's do overhead, but we can still hear you, Michelle, just FYI. Okay. All right, so we've got the six by six adhesive sheets here that she was using. And I want to warn everybody, I've opened up some of these um, goodies already because I could not wait to... Uh, to dive in so some of the packaging is not going to look the best but here is the beautiful mandela stencil i love this stencil then we have the um, rainbow stencil that she used in that card and i want to show you um let me see if i have it really handy i thought i did well maybe not I don't know where it's at. All right, moving on, Brandy. <laughs> All right, so then we also have this cute nesting um, uh, die set right here. I've already dug into that one already. Oh, here's the card. That's the card that I created with that rainbow um, stencil. But as you can see, some of the negative area, negative space, the flock stuck to because I had pixie spray on the back of that stencil. And this um, backing, this little halo for the word die, I used the double-sided um, double sided adhesive sheets and then die-cutted that um, outline out. And that was this die right here, the thanks, with the halo um, cut out of that. And I, I don't know if you um, are familiar with this product 
um, Michelle, but I used some of this Design Master Clear Finishing Matte Spray. Because okay. I find that when um, I spray or use with uh, any kind of glitter or whatnot, sometimes it comes off. And so I use this to kind of spray it down to kind of hold it down a little bit better. I sell that in, in my store. Yeah. All right. So we got that. And then we also have the hugs. I love the hugs. It's also got that cute little halo die right there. So cute. And then here is that rainbow. Um, uh, which one is this one called? The rainbow friend die that you showed. Definitely with the little word friend and the halo there. Okay, here we go. Now let's look at all this goodness stuff right here. We have got all kinds of flock here. And you said you have how many colors? We have 16 colors. Oh my goodness. So we've got all of this flock right here. And then we've got um, some of your silver bells, super fine glitter, which is what I use to create this background. And then we've got the glossy gel. And I believe you also sent me some palette knives, but I can't find them because I used them the other day. <laughs> So I think that was also included in the um, the bundle as well. So we have got a fantastic bundle here. Thank you so much, Michelle, for sending all of this crafty goodness to me. It was so fun to play with. Oh, I'm glad you enjoyed it. All right. Let's go ahead and bring Michelle back on. Let's see here. Okay, there you are. All right, so let's go ahead and do our giveaway. Don't forget, folks, 25% off this evening when you use that promo code and click through that link. All right, so I think I accidentally closed out my giveaway screen. Let me get that back. Okay, so I want to see in the comments who is dying to get some flock. Let me see them in the comments now. Just blow it up right now. Show Michelle some love. Let's see how many, who wants those um, block containers? Lots of you do, I know it. All yeah. right, we do. Somebody says, drum roll please, me, me, me. Yes, please, yes, please, flock yeah. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and draw the winner. I won't drag it out anymore. All right, there we go. Okay, this one is going to Robin and Robin is spelled R-O-B-B-Y-N. Last name starts with a J and ends with an S. Robin, we are going to be emailing you and it'll come from support at stantmesomelove.com just to confirm you're an actual human, not a bot. So we can get your mailing address and then we can send that to Michelle so she can send that to you directly. Awesome. Great. Congrats, Robin. Yay. Yay. Um, uh, Michelle, did you have anything else you wanted to share? Any kind of upcoming release you've got going on or anything like that? Well, like I said today, we have a brand new release. All our Easter and spring is out there, and um, that code is a great way to save on that. There's usually never codes for brand new stuff, so that's a way way to get it now and save. Awesome. Okay, but you got to do it before 10 p.m. because well, that code is going to go away. Yes. Yep. So let's sell her out. Can we do that? Hey, that would that be awesome. okay? Yeah, that'd, that'd be, be awesome. All right. That'd be all right. <laughs> that'd be it. That'd be a good problem to have, right? Yeah. <laughs> all right, Michelle. Well, it was great crafting with you. Thank you so much for oh, joining well. us tonight. Thanks to all of you as well. You enjoy right. the rest of the weekend. We'll do. We'll do. Thank you. Bye bye. Right, thanks. Bye bye. All right. Wasn't that awesome? I love how she used the um, uh, the double sided adhesive um, paper to kind of, you know, mix those different colors together and um, and get that kind of rainbow effect. Uh, her cards look a whole lot better than mine <laughs> than mine do. Note to self, don't put pixie, pixie spray on a stencil if you want to flock it. So. All right. So let's see what time we've got here. So we've got a, a good minute. 
So we're going to do some giveaways. Who is ready for some more giveaways? Let me see it. Blow me up in the comments. All right, let me just go over and make sure what I've given away. Okay, we've given that away. We've given that away. And we've given that away. Okay. Oh, let me also get that one away. All right, so let's pop over here. And let me pull out some more stuff. All right. And I am running out of space here. Good problem to have. All right, let's go ahead. Put my stuff out of the way. All right, so we are going to be giving away some more Colorado Craft stamp sets. I've got one, two, three, four. We're going to do five of them all in rapid succession. So let's pull these out again. I know I have shown these a lot, but we're going to do it again anyway. So we've got the charcuterie board. We've got the wedding day. Again, this is the stamp set that Daniel is going to be using Sunday when he does his live stream for Colorado Craft. We've got the orchid stamp set. We've got this cute little bunny this is new baby stamp set and then we've got dad's cooking all right so we're going to give away five of these bundles let's do it let's do it i hope you're ready lisa we're going to do it rapid fire all right you guys let's draw for a winner okay so the first winner for the colorado craft stamp set bundles going to catherine Catherine's name is spelled K-A-T-H-Y-N. Last name starts with a W and ends with a Y. All right. We're going on to number two. Rapid fire. Let's see here. We're going to give this one to Kim. Last name starts with an R and ends with an S. All right. That's number two. Here's number three. All right, this one's going to Jackie. Last name starts with a V and ends with a U. All right, so that was three. This is four. And this one is going to Cindy. Last name starts with a G and ends with an H. And I have been seeing her comment tonight, so I know she is in the house. All right, we've got one more for tonight for Colorado Craft Company. All right, this one is going to Mary Lou. Last name starts with an M and ends with an S. All right, that over there. Let's see what time is it? All right, we've got some more time. So let's do our next one. We're gonna be doing the Tombow Bundle. Let's see how many you've got to do on this one. So one, two, we're going to do two of these. All right, so we've got the alcohol uh, markers here. They're ABT Pro markers in the blue tones. Let's see if I have that card still around here. I must have put it up. All right, then we've got the mono glue sticks. And then we have the air touch um, glue tape. All right, we're going to do two of these, Lisa. All right, first one is going to Misty. Last name starts with an M and ends with an L. All right, second one is going to. Carol. Carol's last name starts with an H and ends with an S. All right. There we go. All right. Let's mark this out here. Okay. We're going to do some My Colors Heavyweight Cardstock. Y'all, this is the um, cardstock that I sell in my store. And just a little tip, 
um, when you purchase paper from Stamp Me Some Love, you also will get a card swatch, card stock swatch rather. And um, if you uh, want to, you can purchase it for $5.99 or if you purchase paper, you get it for free. And it just gives you a sample of all of the different colors and um, weights that we sell in the store. I find uh, buying paper online is difficult unless I've already seen the paper because computer monitor screens don't show the color accurately. I know that some, even some of the colors in my store online, they look very similar to each other. Like some of the reds look very similar. The pinks look very similar to each other, but they are completely different shades. All right. So we are going to give away, let's see how many, we're going to give away two of these paper packs. All right. And then Lisa, if you don't mind putting in the uh, comment section, the URL to our store. All right, so this one is going to Diane. Last name starts with a B and ends with a T. And then the second one is going to go. Wait a minute. Hold on one second. I think I just called out somebody's name twice. Let me just double check. No, yes, Diane. Diane did win that last one. And then this one is going to Jessica. Last name starts with a G and ends with an R. Okay, so we've got the paper pack out. And let's see, what else do we have here? That one's done, 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 done. All right, who is interested in, let me change the camera over. Who is interested in some VIP all access passes? And I want to see in the comments who has their VIP all access pass and is loving it. Blow me up. Show me the heart. Show me the loves, all the likes. Love it. Thank you. All right. So we are going to give away. We're going to give away three of them. Three of them. All right. Now, don't forget, if you've already purchased your VIP All Access Pass and you are a giveaway winner, I will refund that for you. All right, so let's go ahead and do it. We're going to do three of them, Lisa. Okay, we're going to give this one away to Allison, A-L-L-I-S-O-N. And last name starts with a B and ends with an L. Let's say three, one, two, three. Yeah, we're gonna do three. All right. Next one goes to LaCroix, L-A-C-R-O-I-X. Last name starts with an N and ends with an A. All right, so that's two. Give another one. All right, this one is going to Wendy. And Wendy's last name starts with an M and ends with an Y. Let me just double check on my time. We are looking really good. Got that one. That one, that one. All right, I've got something I want to show you guys. What I do with it? Oh, here it is. Oop, almost fell. All right, we shared this in our kickoff call, but some of you might have not been on that live. So this right here is a glass mat, and let me share something on the screen here. One second, here we go. All right, so Glass um, Board Studios is one of our sponsors and they have sent this beautiful glass mat 
it is the same mat that I've got right here and it is magnetic so let me just show you you can get these magnets all right so it looks like Lisa's telling me something uh, is it not working all right let me check that when uh, we take a break before the next um, live I will check out that link so Lisa just uh, send me a reminder to do that okay so this um, mat is magnetic and you can purchase um, magnets these really strong magnets I don't know if you can hear that or not but it is really strong and I'm gonna flip the camera over and you can kind of see on the back side here that's where the um, magnet is it's really heavy duty and um, we're going to give away one of these guys tonight um, that mat is worth $99 that's what it sells for on their on their website but they've given us a promo code um, to go to and if you'll just follow that link that's showing there right there in the big banner and use the promo code success 20 you're going to get 20 percent off they have the mats in different sizes they also have a black mat but I will tell you if you're thinking about doing any kind of any kind of overhead filming don't get the black mat because it reflects um, uh, poorly and it shows a lot of light on it so it's really hard to see or it's irritating or annoying so get the white mat white mat if you're thinking about doing any kind of uh, videoing of your work um, they also have uh, mats that are decorated. You know, they've got like flowers or, you know, it, they're really cute. And it's a great addition to your, um, your craft room. All right. So let's go ahead and give that away. All right, so the Glassboard Studios is going to Kim. And Kim's last name is B and uh, starts with a B and ends with a T. All right, that's awesome. That was a really awesome giveaway. All right, let's see what my time looks like. We still got some time left. Let me just see here. All right. You know what? I think it's a good time for us to take a break. So Ellen Hudson's going to be coming on at eight o'clock. So we're going to take a break. Now, I just want to remind everybody that um, to go to the schedule page and I'll put that link up right here. Go to the schedule page and scroll down to you find the Ellen Hudson live stream. If you can't find it on the schedule page, just go to my YouTube channel. You'll find it there. I'm also streaming this in the Facebook group uh, and then also on my Facebook business page. So you should be able to find it. Just hop on over there and we will meet up around eight o'clock. All right, you guys take care. I'll see you in the next video.